Reinvigoration and NHS Shared Business Services worked together on a large process transformation project. The largest finance and accounting process within this department is Procure to Pay. For this team, undergoing a lean transformation process meant changing the way that they worked. The most frustrating aspect of my role is probably knowing that things aren't right and knowing that the processes need improving. I absolutely want lean deployment to be able to create a great team who absolutely walk in every day, know what they're doing, know that they're delivering, know that they have a responsibility and an ownership to make a difference. The transformation was structured into six phases. The diagnose phase identified a very fragmented process with a lot of waste built in. This diagram shows the complexity of the process with invoices moving back and forth between multiple teams with a lack of ownership endemic throughout the process. While there were clear trends in the types of errors and delays present throughout the process, little was being done to drive out root causes. This was compounded by the fact that teams were driven to meet productivity targets as opposed to quality targets. Spans of control across the teams were inconsistent, with managers spending too much time on non-core activities. No daily performance meetings were held and attempts at visual management were unstructured and not performance-driven or up-to-date. With Reinvigoration's help, the entire process has been redesigned via a series of workshops held by the global P2P team. There are now 13 customer-focused, multi-functioning teams that manage the end-to-end -end P2P process for specific clients. Quality is now built into the process and no invoices move to the next change unless all information is present and correct. In support of the new process, the introduction of standard operating procedures, new performance hubs and daily team huddles has helped give teams clearer direction and targets. In addition, staff have undergone team problem-solving training, enabling them to work more effectively and freeing up team leaders to focus on leadership and coaching. So the staff development throughout the pods has been, has been great. We've taken some people who were working in the post room, people who had worked in the post room for seven, eight years, um, and they put themselves forward for the development opportunity to go and work in the pod. And the feedback we've had from them is just that they absolutely love it. It's certainly driven uh, a whole change in cultural behaviour to look at improvement where it, it never did that before. Based on the P2P stuff, absolutely an advocate of the lean approach. It's it's everything we need to do. It's focusing on the customer, it's focusing on ownership, it's taking charge of your, de your own destiny. But it's a structured approach which can be developed by the people who are running with it. It's just, it's just amazing for me to get that sense of ownership again and the people moving forward with it.